Commerce joining us now in a first on CNBC interview is Dax De Silva, Lightspeed Commerce CEO. Dax, welcome to the show. Thanks um, for it's such a you're you're in such a key area in terms of the read through to retailers and restaurants and all of these right. industries um, that are kind of on the front lines of not only economic growth and the health of the consumer, but reopening efforts as well. What are you seeing? Yeah, we've seen a very strong reopening in this quarter. It shows in our numbers, as you mentioned. 200% growth, but we also saw GTV, which is our transaction volume, also grow 200% in this quarter. So we're seeing strong reopenings. It's, dri it's driving strong demand for light speed. Uh, and also, light, there's, a, there's a lot of new customers and existing customers that are expanding their services with us. So we are seeing the reopening in play. And, you know, we saw a lot of e-commerce during the, during the height of the pandemic. And now we're seeing, you know, uh, in-store, in-restaurant sales uh, triple in this quarter. Yeah, I'm curious about the competitive landscape. I mean, certainly Square would get mentioned uh, when, in, in terms of this payments processing business, but also Shift4 is another name um, as well. How would you, I guess, how would you describe the landscape and what is it taking for you to acquire more of these potential customers, especially when you're talking about companies like SpaceX? Yeah, so the, you know it, the commerce landscape is 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 really wide, and there's there are cloud-based players that are serving different segments of the market. We're serving about 12 verticals in retail and hospitality, uh, and, and one of those verticals is golf, so it's a kind of a hybrid uh, that have the more complex needs. So it's it's retailers with tens or hundreds of thousands of SKUs. Uh, it's restaurants that are fine dine or uh, embedded in a hotel or resort like Telluride, uh, and uh, and that's that's sort of light speed sweet spot. We we serve that complex uh, SMB. Uh, uh, and so, you know, we, we want to become and we are becoming that go to name for for those uh, for those verticals. Has the hospitality uh, sector, your, your clients in that space, has it pulled back at all that that 200 percent growth you saw in the past quarter in the last few weeks uh, in light of Delta? Uh, in this lot, in the quarter that we're reporting on, it's almost 400% growth for, for hospitality compared to about 150, 140, 150 for retail. Um, I think it really depends on you know where we're seeing lockdowns. We're still seeing strong GTV across across all our verticals, but you know, for example, APAC uh, Australia, where they are where they are seeing more more uh, more lockdowns, we are seeing more weakness. But uh, it, Lightspeed is a as much as it's a reopening play, it's also a resilience play. Uh, so we enable the the delivery and the the, the takeout and the curbside pickup. Uh, obviously, when when the dining rooms are open, there's a lot more transactions. Uh, and so it's it's definitely uh, better for these businesses to have everything open. Uh, but if if they can't, if they are they are experiencing lockdown, uh, then then they can transition to the digital strategies that we enabled during COVID. So is it that consumers are spending more, or that there's just more frequent transactions? There are more frequent. Well, there's transactions also in in the physical space, whereas they they used to be a bit more uh, the online ordering. Uh, so we, I think we, there is pent up demand. Uh, but I think it's nice to also see these businesses, you know, really resurge in, in terms of visitors. Uh, and, uh, and I think that we're seeing, uh, you know, we're, we're seeing that the, the desire for people to shop local, support local um, and go out to these businesses. Uh, and I think that that's that's and we're also seeing these small businesses become much more uh, comfortable with technology. So I think that these are good trends for, for the, our local community businesses. And we really believe that, uh, you know, that, we, that we're building community through commerce, through everything that we do at Lightspeed.